how do you find business founders and owners that yep. want to work with you? Yep, absolutely. Um, I mean, my my main kind of marketing outreach media uh, channel is LinkedIn. And I do a lot of work on my LinkedIn to, you know, to make sure that I'm constantly posting. I mean, I'm posting three, four or five times a week. Um, I've got a newsletter now that's got uh, nearly 3000 followers. Um, so just, I mean, one of the key things is consistently putting out content and it's, it, one of the things that really intrigues me is, you know, I'll, I'll be at an event and I'll bump into somebody that I'm connected with and, and, and they'll say, oh, I've been following all your content. And I said, well, why don't you, why don't you hit the like button or, or post a comment? I mean, it's great that you're seeing it, but please engage. Um, so I, you know, that's, that's, that's a, that's a key thing. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm a very outgoing person. So I love going to events. I love going to, you know, networking functions. Um, I'm a member of a couple of uh, organizations in here in London where, you know, whether they, they put on regular events that I go out and, you know, meet people. And as a result of that, I've, I've, I've built up a, you know, a reasonably wide network. From a marketing perspective, uh, when I look at my business today, all of my main clients have actually been inbound leads from people who said, oh, you need to talk to David. Uh, and that's then when, you know, cases of wine get shipped out to people and things like that. <laughs> so, but yeah, no, so, so. David, I think there's, there's a lot of businesses out there that they start out because they've got connections in the space, in the industry that they want to reach and they, they know they can sell directly to their network and then they kind of get lost in that referrals and partnerships space. Uh, people make it too hard for people to refer to them. They're not clear enough on what they do. So people struggle to refer to them. And I, you know, I've just been yeah. through a course myself in, you know, in, in strategy and partnerships. Big shout out to Dave who, who runs that course. It's fantastic. I think that there is a, like, the, 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 the LinkedIn gurus will have you believe that it doesn't work for long and you've got to have another approach. You've got to have, you know, um, pay per click. You've got to have a really good website. You've got to be doing all these things that can become quite expensive. But the truth of the matter is, for certain businesses, and not this doesn't apply to every business, but certainly in the B2B space, it's very possible to have a very strong referral network. So I guess the, the, the question yeah. would be to you is, how do you go about making sure that your network understand how to market you? Because that's effectively what they're doing, right? Mm, 